over the weekend? <laughs> it was pretty grim, wasn't it? Yeah, in fact, some parts of our region in the first week of November have already seen over a month's worth of rain, and I'll have more on that on tonight's Look East. As for this afternoon, largely cloudy skies, perhaps a bit of brightness and sunshine for some of us, but overall rather grey with some rain or drizzle at times. Temperatures on the mild side for the time of year and this afternoon we could potentially have gusts from the southwest between 30 and 40 miles per hour at times. So this evening and tonight, some blustery showers and some clear spells. And then later tonight, a cold front racing uh, west to east and this band of rain shooting through, but some of it will be on the heavy side and it will be accompanied by very blustery winds. Gusts 35 to 45 miles per hour, perhaps even up to 50 miles per hour in places. And temperatures for most of us staying in double figures. So this is the overnight front. It races away onto the continent tomorrow, behind it very unsettled conditions. So some spells of November sunshine on Tuesday, but also some very blustery showers. And some of these could be heavy and potentially thundery in places too. Top temperatures tomorrow, well, values between about 14 and 15 degrees Celsius. So for many of us, a good few degrees above average for the time of year. And we could still potentially have those winds or with gusts of around 35 to 45 miles per hour, particularly during those showers. Now, Wednesday, still quite breezy, but uh, not as windy as tomorrow. And uh, a few showers, but largely fine and dry. And from Thursday, potentially right the way through until the beginning of next week, high pressure in charge is likely to keep us fine and dry and on the mild side by day and by night.